what is it we're doing? We're driving to Chen State. It is way more fun to travel standing up than it is to travel standing down. Uh, <laughs> sitting down. After riding 12 hours, many have had to go to the bathroom. So we're in this town, and the girls are having to go down a ladder. I have to throw it because I cannot climb the ladder with it in my hand. Oh, there's a bathroom right there. Yes. Well, the one I went to before was like one mile away. This is a special one. Oh, they just made this one. Very fortunate. Well, the video can't capture all this, and I don't think we want to capture what's going to happen. Yo, what's going on right at this very moment right here now, in Mindat? What I'm time sure. is it? Oh my gosh, it's like 1.30, 1.45, okay. something like that. What's going on? We're holding a flashlight so these ladies can come up the ladder okay. from the subterranean bathroom. Okay. Um, and I've we, heard reports of foul play down there. I'm going down there. Rodents. I, I'm going. You next. should. But but no. What, you can't experience mendacity. What is that that I can. smell on you right at this moment? Oh, that's some very lovely peppermint essential oil. Someone had a little bit of issue on the bus. Oh, there was some literally food. issue. It issued right it out. It issued of out. Okay. And. And the bus had a smell. It almost caused many other issues. Yeah. This okay. peppermint gonna, oil is helping peppermint me a lot. Oil. You know what? This is something that is essential. It is essential. For the Mendat thing. For this trip. This is this is the true this definition. Is, this is young living right here. Right. Because if, yeah. if we didn't have that, we'd be hurling on the side we of the road. We would not be living. No. We'd be young death. Essential oils, new definition of you essential. You can't see it, but it's there. I can smell it. I can smell it from here. They'll smell it on the video. That's how good it is. Okay, it, what time is it, guys? About 7? 6.30 or 7 o'clock in the morning. We're in Chin State between Mendat and uh, Seven Mile, 70 Mile Village. And uh, as the sun was rising, we needed to stop and check the tire pressure. And uh, I've successfully done that. Um, now we're freezing to death. It's like so cold, it's unbelievable. But girls, is this pretty? Yeah. It's gorgeous. All right, and it looks like Josh is going. <laughs> 
Josh is going to set up the drone. Okay, what's the right, back, guys. Stay back. Stay back. Okay, guys. the drone. So Josh is flying the drone from inside the vehicle. This is what the drone is seeing. We'll be looking at the footage. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Did you see anything on the road up there? It was just lying. <laughs> are, are you lying? No, it was, it was really there. <laughs> but I think it was too scared of me. <laughs> it is 8 o'clock in the morning, and we've been on the road since 4 a.m. Well, 4.30, I think is what it was. Beautiful mountains. Serious road going on here. The roads are extraordinary. You can see there what they're doing in the road here and believe it or not, we're driving on it. They take these barrels up here that you see, they build fires under them and they melt black top and then they pour in there and you can see little Bubba here is helping out on the edge of a giant right, on the edge of the cliff. Yeah. And they get ready to start their fires and start melting. See that black stuff on fire? It's a hell thing. So. Obviously, the roads are good. How do you, Steve, what do you think about the roads? I think my wife would love it. I think your wife would love it? Okay. Amid this beautiful backdrop of incredible mountains, the roads here in the area during the rainy season get completely destroyed, and so they're always rebuilding them. And these road crew workers melt the tar on the side of the road by hand. It's amazing. Now we stopped here to get gas and we met this woman and uh, her little baby, little baby boy, he's a year and a half old, her and her husband live here in this building here and they have for about five or six years and um, we talked to them and she is a Christian, she goes to a Baptist church. What'd you say, John? It's like, um, I've been to a lot of coffee shops, but I, have a I think house, this so one beats them all. Just, well, it's got a better view, probably. Definitely. Can you see out that window here? Absolutely gorgeous view. Yeah, yeah. yeah. no. I'll have to walk over to see it. Quite a view. This is a gas station. If you take these water bottles and they fill them with gasoline. And here they're hand pumping the diesel into the bus. They store it and transport it and these keep it in these barrels. So it's kind of like a gas station. Ready? No, clean me. Oh, no, no, no. 
Okay, this is really difficult. You're doing it upside down. Yeah, I'm trying to. Time to roll up. Yep. So they've invited a bunch of the young people to ride motorcycles with them up the hill. So uh, Benjamin volunteered, Elizabeth, and now some of the other girls. So we'll see who gets on, who doesn't. All right, Rebecca's riding off on a motorcycle. Elizabeth, Benjamin. After 20 some 25 hours of driving, we come to Machu P and they are making a feast for us. This is fish from their river. It's lovely. Chicken, which I watched them uh, plucking and cleaning, so it's as fresh as the day is long. Some local items here. This is a flower uh, that they cook in lime. And uh, this is something else, but we're about to have us a feast, and we're here, and we're very thankful. David. Yes, sir. And Elder oh. Roe Yoon. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He speaks a little That's English. Wonderful. He's like as good as um, like, King Mummy. Benzo is like two words. Yeah. So, so, yeah, yeah, sorry, in the Sometimes I visit there and invite them to like the church. Woo! <laughs> we have tasted better water, but. Yeah.